Welcome to the third hour in the School of Information Technology and Communication Design Capstone Festival. My name is Kevin Cahill, I'm the instructor for the Capstone course. Uh, this is our largest Capstone class ever, and because of that, we are limiting today's presentations to four minutes each, <laughs> or less, hopefully. And uh, <clears throat> we're going to begin. Andrew. Okay, so my name is Andy Donaldson. Um, my client was Art Sam, and my advisor is Dr. Beauty. So this is what the office looks like. Very beautiful, as you can see. So problem is going to be it's a software. Art Sam is a software security company that routinely accepts license updates for the software that they already created. Um, right now, it in, involves an intern getting an email um, saying, hey, I need a new license. And that's inefficient, that's costly, and it can, it can be human error that way. So <laughs> so solution, automate licensing process. Quicker turnaround that way. No room for human error on, mostly no room for human error because the client will still be inputting in their information. Um, I'm not an application that replaces it. Yeah, it's a, yeah it, make, connect, it makes a connection between the client, the information server, and the licensing server and returns the license file to the customer. Mm. Ah, um, yeah. So, yeah, this I replace the intern or server side scripting. The user interface is done with the web server, and yeah, I ended up using virtual machines and all sorts of fun stuff like that. <laughs> and so, some of the tools our uh, HTML, PHP, both um, language, language, sorry. Um, and then the technical database that was, was something I worked with only over the summer previously, which was Salesforce. And they, hopefully the, they had their own API called Force API. So, but it's still, it was different to work with that. Um, licensing, yeah, they already had a licensing database of sorts. So, but it was, I automated it a lot more. So what I learned, I learned how to use virtual drive in the first place. I learned how to use Postgres, because that's where all the tables were. I learned how to create servers, how to use Salesforce, and I had hoped to do a lot more than I did end up doing. And the, I learned that even though I'm not trying something big, at least I got something. <laughs> 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 so thank you. For, yeah, thank you for your interest. To find out more, please visit my poster session in room 156.